Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com New Windows 10 build to look at This is 21387 for Windows Insiders on the dev channel And there's just one major change with this And that's the removal of Internet Explorer So if I start typing internet there, looking to get Internet Explorer, you'll notice I get the Internet Options, but not actual Internet Explorer. And that's because that's been completely removed from this build, it's no longer supported. Which is definitely not a bad thing, no one uses that really anymore. There may be a few enterprise sites that use it, but they can control that through IE mode and the admin tools for enterprises. But as a consumer, Internet Explorer is gone, and you can now use Edge and the latest version of Edge is, is really good. Up there with Chrome, same rendering engine, and that's what I use. So, Internet Explorer, no more. The other change with this is they got rid of the um, eco mode option where you can right click and put it and put it into eco mode, a task that reduced its resources. Uh, this, they're bringing that back, they say at some point, but they're, they've got rid of it at the moment. Uh, we're working on some fixes for it. The rest of the changes are just fixes. They fixed some issues with um, uh, New Times Roman showing during a reboot as it was updating the build. They fixed some WSL issues. Um, they fixed some Windows update issues when you pause it and then it, and you resume it would be unresponsive. They fixed a couple of .NET issues and the blue screen when using uh, OneDrive Personal Vault. And there's just um, a few known issues with this one. The Windows camera app does not respect the camera settings. Uh, search uh, may not display correctly in the dark theme. Using interest may uh, not fly out correctly. It might come from the top. And using interest is that new feature that uh, I've shown you a few builds now, um, which is there. And that um, might not show correctly. And there. Uh, working on a fix for an issue where some builds may not update correctly and it uh, and it comes up with an error code. Uh, if you get that, you have to pause that and think, pause your builds while they're fixing on that. And that's it, really. That That's the change of this build. So Internet Explorer is no more. Um, later in this year, we're going to see a lot of new features come to Windows 10, I think, on the UI front, but not at the moment. So there we go. That's the changes. So a very quick build video today. Thanks for watching this one. If you like it, please uh, uh, put your thumbs up or subscribe. And uh, you can find me on Twitter at Annie Stixon. I'll see you on the next one.